Just this morning, guys released information about the first Battle Pass vehicle along with a temporary sale on a vehicle. First, the Valtor IIN is temporarily back and available at a discount for its anniversary of its first flight. From now until October 18th, the Valtor has a 30% discount and you can pick it up for 5,992 GE. This vehicle is labeled as a bomber and is placed at 9.0 without flares, so it's really bad in my opinion, but you do get access to the funny AA Nords. Along with the AS-20 and AS-30 Nords, which are actually really good air-to-ground missiles, except they're all M-close, so they're extremely hard to aim. I would basically only get this vehicle as a collector's item, it's not worth grinding with it. As for the Battle Pass vehicles, the first confirmed one is the Murmansk. This is a premium light cruiser for the USSR at rank 3. It does have 10 152mm cannons, powerful air defense, radar, decent survivability, and a high top speed. Funny enough, this vehicle was part of the US Navy before it was lend-leased over to Russia. Its original name was the Milwaukee CL5. And this does partially confirm one of the leaks that came out a few days ago about the upcoming battle pass. 